welcome back. I know we are well into the month of June already, but I still want to show you my favorite products of last month. There are some cute things here that I think you guys will really love as well, so I am going to show them to you. So let's just roll right on into it, and I hope that you guys enjoy. The first thing I want to show you is by Neutrogena, and this is their Shine Control Powder, and it has rice protein complex. If you have oily skin or your skin tends to get like shiny throughout the day, I definitely recommend applying a blotting powder like this one. It is serious business. This will soak up oil and it'll keep it matte for hours and hours. The only problem, the only downside that I have with this is because it's so mattifying, I find that it almost looks a little bit um, cardboardy on the face but this powder works amazing for the t-zone especially for all my oily skinned girls out there it's um, affordable you can get it at the drugstore and it works amazingly the next product is also from the drugstore and this one is by physicians formula and it is a beautiful beautiful blush i have just been obsessed with this color it's kind of like a pinky peachy color it is just gorgeous. What I like about this powder as well is that it's very, very blendable and it's very pigmented, which is rare to find from like drugstore um, blushes. And I find that this one in particular just works really well. This next product is also from the drugstore. It is by L'Oreal and it is their True Match Concealer. It is absolutely amazing. I don't need to use my um, Bobbi Brown corrector underneath. It does such a good job of covering up any darkness under my eyes. It's very blendable, it has great coverage, and it stays on for a really long time, and I don't find that it creases a lot. Plus, it's from the drugstore, which is amazing because it's not that expensive, and you can find it pretty much anywhere. So I do apply this underneath my eyes, and I also bring it up here onto my cheekbones and down the center of my nose to just give more like light in the center of the face. And moving on to the last product from the drugstore, this is the um, OPI Nail Envy Nail Strengthener. I spoke about this product a few months ago, but I stopped using it since I started doing shellac, which lasts for like one to two weeks, which is amazing. But I do like to give my nails a break from shellac once in a while. And when I do that, I apply this Nail Envy um, Nail Strengthener to my nails, and it makes my nails so hard and it lets them grow, it doesn't um, allow them to break as easily and I have recommended this to a few friends and all of them have said that they loved it and that it really helped their nails grow stronger. So if your nails are a bit more on the weaker side, just apply a coat of this underneath your regular nail polish and it will hopefully help your nails as well to um, remain strong and to grow out nice and long. So moving on to a product that's very exciting for me, my new um, face moisturizer. I deal with breakouts, oily skin, dry cheeks. I have to be very careful with any products that I put on my face. This is the Peter Thomas Roth Ultra Light Oil Free Moisturizer. It's like a jelly type of lotion and it's not heavy at all but it really really moisturizes. It just works so well with my skin. Like it's like made for my skin. It goes great underneath makeup. It obviously doesn't have any perfumes or super harsh chemicals that could irritate your skin. It is a little bit more on the pricey side, but when it comes to products like this, I don't mind spending a little bit more money, especially if it has to do with my face and like the overall well-being of my skin. Next product is a perfume, and it's so cute. This is the Hello Kitty um, perfume in like the little roller ball um, packaging. It's just so adorable, and it smells amazing. I love keeping this in my bag because it is so nice and small and I just remove the head like that and then I roll this right underneath um, right here on my neck and I'll roll it on my wrist like that and then sometimes I'll also put it behind my ears. It smells so fresh and girly and summery. So moving on to some non-beauty favorites, the first thing I want to show you guys are these adorable socks from a company called Happy Socks. And all of these are designed in Sweden, which is my country, so I have to represent for all my Swedish people. Probably the most adorable socks I have ever seen. They come in so many different um, styles. And the reason I have so many is because my friend's boyfriend works at the company. They wanted to see if I'd be interested in picking out a few pairs 
of these socks. I went onto the website and I just loved all the designs. They're super cute. They're very like trendy. These socks, I'm going to wear them when I wear boots in like the fall time or even if you're at home and you want to like snuggle a little bit, it's a little bit cold. And I also think that they're great for men who are into like fashion when you sit down and you wear certain types of pants the pants go up, you know, so you can see like the little peak of um, like a really cute sock. And I think this is a great place to go get like a cute little gift for someone who you might not know like what to get. It's an easy idea and you know, everyone needs socks and why not have them like in um, cute colorful prints like this. And I also picked out a few pairs of these for my dad and it's Father's Day next week. This for example is a pair that I'm going to give to my um, dad. So moving on to two candles from one of my favorite places to get candles from, which is Bath and Body Works. The first one is this Honeysuckle, and I've had this now for a few weeks, and I've been burning it every single day, and it's still halfway. So it does last a very long time, and it makes my whole room smell amazing. The scent of this is like very soft. It almost smells like you just got out of like a fresh bubble bath. It's like a bit like of a vanilla, obviously a little bit of honey, and it just smells amazing. And this next one is called Tiki Beach, and if you guys know my channel, you know that I'm like obsessed with anything that smells like remotely beachy. And this one smells really good, and it smells like a fresh floral twist on... Uh, a beachy smell if that makes any sense. If you want like a more in-detailed review of both of these candles, I'll link my blog post that I did on them down below. Still loving them, they're amazing. The last three things I want to show you are actually food related. I'm always like finding like healthier alternatives to different things. So for example, the first thing I want to show you is a um, pasta, but it's made from quinoa and it tastes so good. Quinoa, if you guys aren't familiar with, is a grain that's very, very healthy for you. They take rice flour and quinoa flour and they make um, these pastas and they taste so good you would never tell that they are not like real pasta. What I like about these is that when you eat them afterwards you don't feel like super heavy or that you don't want to move around like regular pasta might make you feel. I really like them and definitely recommend them if you want to make a switch to a healthier alternative to regular pasta. The second thing is trading like regular potato chips for a um, fruit chip. And these are um, bare fruit cinnamon apple chips. And there's nothing else in here except for um, apples and um, cinnamon. So as you can see, the ingredients are right there. And they taste amazing. They're sweet, they're crunchy. And it's just a nice little snack to have, like if you're watching a movie, but you don't want to eat like, you know, bad um, chips or something like that, and you still want to snack on something, definitely um, try this out. And the last thing I want to show you are black beans. I like having these in the morning with eggs, again, to replace any like carby thing like um, bread, for example. And it's great because they digest very slowly, so they're going to release energy very slowly, which means that it's going to keep you full for longer. And it's also great for regulating um, blood sugar levels. And of course, beans are a great protein as well. I just put these on um, a stove top just to warm them up a little bit, and they're amazing. So those are my favorite products of the month. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please feel free to leave your favorite um, product of the month down below in the comments. It's always nice hearing from you guys and seeing what you guys have liked as well. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I hope everyone is having a great day and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye guys!